So here's what we have cooking today in the truck. As you can see, there's a nice fresh wrap, some buffalo chicken mac and cheese, and some meatballs. Now these meals aren't only good for your kids, they're actually made to exceed national health standards. You excited to see these around the school? Yeah, it's gonna be really cool. <laughs> Douglas Anderson sophomore Jillian Crookshank is ready to see her design hit the streets and the schools. Today, school district personnel gave it a try. Crookshank won a district-wide contest coming up with the colorful creation and the name Brain Food. Eating junk food, is, like, it doesn't help you in school. So eating fruits and vegetables are way better than eating like chips or cookies or whatever they used to sell at lunches. The school district awarded a $50 million food service contract to the North Carolina company Chartwells to cover Duval County's 160 schools. It'll actually be free, reduced, paid. It doesn't matter what your status is. You can get a complete meal off this truck. Assistant Superintendent Paul Soares says it's all to give the students healthy options and reach more children. In some schools, there are kids that are hungry, and the meals they receive at the schools are really important for them. Thank you very much. The district will start serving these meals in the schools next month, starting with secondary schools and eventually moving into elementary schools. Reporting on the South Bank, Russell Colburn, CBS 47 Action News, Jax.